Try this terms from page number 212. Find the area for following parallelograms. So here parallelograms are there. Now formula to find area of parallelogram is equals to base into height. Now here in this figure, this is going to be the height and this will be our base. So let us multiply them. Base is 8 centimeter and height is 3.5 centimeter. Let us multiply them. First we are avoiding decimal point and we are multiplying them. So 35 into 8, 8 into 5 is 40, 0, 4. 3 into 8, 24 plus 4 is 28. Now for the decimal point from the ones position one number we are counting because here after decimal point one number is there. So 28 will be the answer. So 28 centimeter square will be the area for this parallelogram. Our second example. In this also we have to find out the area of parallelogram. Our formula is base into height. So this is going to be the base and this is our height. So base is 8 centimeter whereas height is 2.5 centimeter. Let us multiply them. 25 into 8. 5 into 8 is 40. 0, 4. 16 plus 4 is 20. So 200 will be the answer. Now after decimal point one number is there. So from one's position we are counting one number and we are putting decimal point here. So area is going to be 20 centimeter square. Question number 3. In a parallelogram A, B, C, D. So let us mark this parallelogram A, B, C and D. A, B is 7.2 centimeter. So this length is 7.2 centimeter. And perpendicular from C. From C we have to make one perpendicular. And that will be on A, B. To A, B this perpendicular will be there. And that is 4.5 centimeter. So this length is 4.5 centimeter. So this is going to be our height. And this is going to be our base. So area of parallelogram equals to base into height. Our base is 7.2 centimeter. Whereas the height is 4.5 centimeter. Let us multiply them. 72 into 45. We are not counting decimal point now. Six. Let us add them. Now, after decimal point, one number is here and after decimal point, one number is here. So, at both the numbers, one, one number, so one plus one will be two. So, from one's position, one and two. So, here we are going to put a decimal point. If you have any doubt how to multiply the decimal numbers, then please watch my video from the chapter decimal and fractions. Our answer is 32.40. And it is area, so it is going to be centimeter square. So thank you for watching and learning with us.